You know, we are always listening to the concerns of our viewers, and one viewer reached out to us concerned about this. She says a poll worker told her she needed to remove her Black Lives Matter face mask in order to come into the building to vote. But our Naima Abdullahi found the law was actually on the voter's side. It started with a simple email, an 11 Alive viewer who asked the question, can I get turned away for wearing a Black Lives Matter face mask? Nikki Griffin says she was in line at an early voting site in Roswell and was told she couldn't vote. That I was unable to enter unless I turned my mask inside out. And this is the mask that I was wearing. Clearly, it just says Black Lives Matter. There's nothing for one candidate versus another. She says she began to ask questions. And I was told there was no campaigning allowed at the polling place. We contacted a spokesperson for Fulton County, and we're told BLM is considered a non-political affiliation, so voters are allowed to wear apparel with those words. So where's the line that will get you stopped? The Secretary of State's office says if you wear anything that directly promotes a candidate on the ballot, you won't be allowed in the polling place. A MAGA hat would be considered promoting President Donald Trump, or you could be stopped if you're wearing a shirt with Joe Biden's name on it. Nikki Griffin says after asking several questions, she was allowed to go inside and vote, but it made her think of a different scenario. If someone wore a Confederate flag shirt, would they have been turned away? I've decided to contact you all to get the answers. We asked that question to Fulton County and they responded, the only items that can't be worn are those specifically tied to a political party or candidate which means someone with a Confederate flag t-shirt would not be turned away. We're told poll workers do receive a training manual during their in-person training to let them know what's allowed, what's not allowed, and how to handle concerns as they pop up at polling sites. Naima, thank you.